How else do you explain U.S. interventionism throughout the world? What are the alternative explanations? That the United States has gone in to defend democracy? Well, that can't be because we supported dictatorships in most of these countries. We supported a fascist Somoza in Nicaragua, a fascist Batista in Cuba. Again and again, country after country, we didn't support democracy, we support fascists. And in fact, we've overthrown democracies. We overthrew democracy uh, in Guatemala when Arbenz came into power. We overthrew democracy in Brazil when Goulart came into power. In each one of those countries, different leaders, different countries, different histories, different languages, different cultures, but they all had one thing in common. They were beginning to use the political system to tamper with and change the economic and class structure. What Allende was doing in Chile, very democratically, was redistributing some of the gross national income from those who made money from dividends and interest and commissions and rents to those who made money from wages and salaries. Unemployment went down in Chile. Inflation was going down. The rate of inflation was going down. Buying power was increasing for the ordinary people. Popular consumption was increasing. The level of living was bettering in a modest way for the people. Every child in Chile was getting a half a liter of milk under the Allende regime. And when the fascist Pinochet came in, that was one of the first programs he abolished.